All right, you guys, this is what we call the decoy method. Now, the decoy method is very easy to spot because most of them come in, try and make you feel sorry for them right off the bat. This girl's gonna come in, claim she has arthritis and that she's in some crazy amount of pain, while the other girl wanders around the store, scoping it out. So the decoy is gonna go on and on about her pain, start talking about how her mom has it, a bunch of stuff. They're just gonna give you a bunch of unnecessary information just to keep you talking and your mind off the fact that this girl's walking around with a big, empty purse. So the thief is looking for something small and expensive, something that she can steal and then return somewhere else for cash later on. Now, she's gonna go with the four packs of Red Bull. Those are about $8 a pop. She takes three of them, boom. She's got a free $24 hair. So now that the decoy is done with her arthritis story, she's gonna ask him about a pack of American Spirits, you know, get him to turn his back a little, make it easier for her to steal. She's gonna look backwards, you know, gotta make sure your friend's still going ham on those Red Bulls. Now, she's gonna have him press check those American Spirits. You gotta keep the BS going as long as you can. Obviously, she had no intentions on buying these. I mean, what's so special about them? I've tried a box. Oh, I don't want those. Seven dollars is way too much for a pack of cigarettes. Now, if you were paying attention, then you know that the girl on the left now has three four packs of Red Bull in that big purse. Oh, what do you know? Now she wants to talk about fidget spinners. Meanwhile, her buddy over there is zipping up her purse. You know, you can't come up to the counter with Red Bull sticking right out of it. My daughter said they got the ones that up on the end. And she said that she Ma'am, she got it from Come here. here. You Me? Yeah. What? Take out the Red Bulls out of the purse. Out of my purse. Yeah. Oh, wow, I totally didn't know the girl I came in here with was bringing a big empty bag to steal shit. Here, I didn't see you get everything. I'm sorry. I don't know what came over me. So be on the lookout for these two because they're probably robbing you blind or trying to return stolen product to you.